Hello again, this is Jealous from Dungeon Crawler Network here to present you with another one of our Elder Scrolls Online workshop videos. This video in particular will be dealing with those pesky little Lua memory limit errors. Alright, so as you can see right here after logging in, I got a UI error. Lua is reaching its memory limit. You should consider disabling some add-ons and reloading the UI. Now see, this particular error is often caused by people who have a lot of add-ons and possibly the biggest culprit will probably be Master Merchant and some of the big uh, shopkeeper type add-ons when you're part of large trading guilds and whatnot that collects a lot of data. And the Lua has a certain memory limit added to it. So I'm going to show you really quickly how you can help get rid of these errors. First off, we're just going to get out of the game here real quick. And we have to go to where our Elder Scrolls Online folder is. Which is often, especially within uh, Windows 7, it's installed under your document settings. And then you can go to Live RPTS. I have both. You may only have the Live folder, but for now we're working on Live. And there is a text document called the user settings. Now, please take note that to make this effective, because this, this text document gets edited every single time that you're in and out. It has a lot of your account information on there, such as uh, your account name, what mega server you're on. It just makes it quicker. It saves all of that. So when you log in, you have to type your account name in every time when you check the save. But in order to make sure that it doesn't overwrite any changes, you have to make sure that you log out of the game. Any changes you make will simply get overwritten the next time you log out. All right, so now that we're out of the game, you can open up this user settings.txt file. You're going to be looking for a section called Lua Memory Limit MB. Easiest thing to do is do a control, control F, and type in Lua, there we go. And here you can see it, set Lua memory limit MB, currently set to 64 MB. What I would recommend doing is upping this to 128. You can go higher than that if you desire. Um, it, it would depend what you want to do. I'm currently running eight gigs of RAM, so 128, uh, megabytes of memory for the Lua is not going to touch my system at all. I personally believe this shouldn't affect your system at all, but this does affect the amount of memory being held on the client side, especially for any kind of Lua scripting. So if you're barely being able to run the game, this may affect you a little more than it would many other people. Um, but for the average user, setting this to 128 or even 256 will not cause much of a hassle at all. So after you go ahead and make that change, go ahead and save it and close your settings. And I'll reopen again just to show you that it did save. Helps if I control F there and type in my Lua. There it is. Set to 128. All right. We can now relaunch the game. will be able to log right back in and you should not see any more of those Lua script errors. And there we go. No more of those Lua script errors. So remember, if you are part of several large trading guilds and whatnot, or you have an excessive amount of add-ons, you can go ahead and increase that limit as many times as you would like. But please do keep in mind that that is the amount of cache memory you are going to be using on your system. So if you set it really high, make sure that your rig can handle the extra load. All right, that's it for this edition of the Elder Scrolls Online Workshop series. We'll see you next time.